When chap and billies leave the street, and dritty neighbours, neighbours meet, as market days are wearing late and folk begin to tack the gate, as we sit bouncing at the nappy and getting foo and ink a happy, we think now on the landscape smiles, the bosses, waters, slaps and styles that lie between us and our team, where sits our sulking, sullen dame, gathering our brews like gathering storm, nursing our wrath to the blood. This truth far known as Tam O'Shanta, as he, the air in a did canter, all the air farm near a dune some passes, for honest men and bonny lasses. Ah, Tam, had thou but been so wise, as paid the ain wife Kate's advice, she felt thee well thou were a skellin, a blethering, blustering, drunken blellin, that fra November to October, the market day thou was na sober, that every melder with a miller thou sat as long as thou was siller, that every nag was kind of shoein, the smith and you got roaring and fooin, that at the Lord's house, even on Sunday, thou drank for Captain Jean till Monday, she prophesied that late or soon thou wouldst be found deep drowned in dune or catched by warlocks in the muck by Halloween, old haunted crack. Ah, gentle dames, it guards me greet to think how many counsels sweet, how many length and sage advices the husband, free the wife, despise me. But to our tale, a market night. Tam had got planted, uncorrent, fast by an ingle, blazing finely, where Riemann swats it, drank divinely, and at his elbow, suitor Johnny, his ancient, trusted, druthy crony. Tam lived him like a very brother. They had been food for weeks ago. The night drave on with songs and clatter, and I, the ale, was growing better. The landlady in town grew gracious with favours, secret, sweet, and precious. The suitor felt his queerest stories, the landlord's laugh was ready chorus. The storm without, McRae and Russell, Tam did no mind the storm a whistle. Kia, mad to see a man so happy. He drowned himself among the nappy. As bees flee him, the lanes of treasure, the minutes wing their leap with pleasure. Kings may be blessed, but Tam was glorious o'er all the ills of life, victorious. But pleasures are like poppy spread. You see as the flower is bloomed, is shed. Or like the snow falls in the river, a moment white, then melts forever. Or like the borealis rays that flit ere you can point their place. Or like the rainbow's lovely form, a vanishing amid the storm. Nay man can better time nor time, that hour approaches. Tam, my mind, that hour by night's dark arch the key stay. That dreary hour he mounts his feasting, and sick a night to tack the road, as near to your sinner was a broadin. The wind blew as could blow on its last, the rattling showers rose on the blast, the speedy gleams the darkness swole, loud, deep and long the thunder bellowed. That night a child might understand the devil had business. On his hand. Wheel mounted on his grey mare bed, a better never lifted leg. Tam skelped on through dub and mire, despising wind and rain and fire, whilst holding past, fast his good blue bonnet, whilst crooning over some old Scots sonnet, whilst glowering round with prudent cares, lest bogles catch him unaware. Carcalloway was drawing nigh, where tastes and bullets nightly cry. 
By this time, Tam was crossed the ford, where in the snow the chapman smoor, and past the burks and Beaclestain, where drunk and Charlie tracks neck bane, and through the winds and by the cane, where hunters found a murdered bear, and near the thorn, a boon the well, where Mungo's mother hanged herself. A forum doon pours all his bloods. The doubling storm roars through the woods. The lightnings flash from pole to pole. Near and more near the thunders roar, till glimmering through the groaning tree, Carcallon seemed in a blaze. Through Ilka bore the beams were glancing, and loud resounded mirth and dancing. Inspiring bold, John Barleycorn, what dangers thou canst mak us scorn? We think me, we fear the evil. We ushkabe, we'll face the devil. The swat sea reamed in Tammy's noodle fair play. He cared no deals more. But Maggie stood, right sear astonished, till by the heel and hand admonished, she ventured onward on the light. And then Tam saw an uncaw sight. Warlocks and witches in a dance. Nay, Cotillon brent new for France, but hornpipes, jigs, strathspeys and reels put life and metal in their heels. A winnick bunker in the east. There sat old Nick in shape a beast, a towsy tyke, black, grim and large. To give them music was his charge. He screwed the pipes and garden and scurril till roof and rafters all did dull. Coffins stood rude like open presses that showed the deed in their last dresses and by some devilish cantrip slight, each in his cold horn held a light by which heroic Artam was able to note upon the daily table a murderer's bane to the gibbet islands. Twa span long we and christened beards. A thief new cut it frae a reap, where his last gasp his garb did gape. Five tomahawks with blood red rusted, five scimitars with murder crusted, a garter which a bairn had strangled, a knife a feather's throat had mangled, for his ain son a life bereft. The grey hair yet stark pure head. We mere of horrible and awful, which even to name would be unlawful. Three lawyers' tongues turned inside out will lie, seemed like a beggar's clit. Three priests' hearts rotted, black as muckly, stinking vile in every leak. As Annie glowered, amazed and curious, the mirth and fun grew fast and furious. The pipe her loud and louder blew, the dancers quick and quicker flew, they reeled, they set, they crossed, they clicked, till Ilka, Carl, and Swart had wicked and kissed her diddies to the whack, and linked it in her sack. Now Tam, oh Tam, had they been twines, oh plump and strapping in their teens, their sacks instead of tissue flannin, been snow white seventeen hundred linen. Their breeks of mine, my only fear, which ends for flush a good blue hair, I would have given them off my herbies, for they bling to they bonny birdies. But withered bell dams, old and droll, rigwoody hags with spin a foal, loupin and flinging on their crimmicks. I wonder did they turn their stomachs. Tam kent what was hot too brawly. There was a winsome wench and wally that night enlisted in the corps, long after came to her shore, where many a beast to dead she shot, and perished money upon a boat, and shook beneath meekle corn and beer, and kept the countryside in fear. Her pretty sark of Paisley harm, which while a lassie she had worn, in longitude was sorely scanty, but was her best, and she was hearty. Ah, little kent thy reverend granny, that sark she caught for her wee nanny, with twop and scots. Twas all her riches, with there a grace, a dance, the witches. 
but hear my news. Her wingman cure. Such flights are far beyond her power to sing how nappy laugh and flung. A simple jade she were, and strong, and how calm stood like aim bewitched, and thought his very een enriched. Even Satan glowered and fidgeted who fain and hotched and blew with mind and main till first day keeper signed another, Tam tints his reason all together and roars out, Well done, Catisark! And in an instant all went dark. And scarcely had he Maggie rallied than out the hellish legion sallied as bees buzz out with angry fight when plundering herds assail their pike. As open pussies, mortal foes, when pop she starts afore her nose, as eager runs a market crowd, when catch the thief, resounds a loud, so Maggie runs the witches fall away money, an eldritch screech, and fall. Oh, Tam, oh, Tam, thou get thy fairin, in hell they'll roast thee like a hen. In vain I keep await thy coming. Kate soon will be a woeful woman. Now do I speed the utmost, Meg, and win the key stain in a minute. They're at them now. Thy tail may toss a running stream. They dare not cross. But ere the key stain she can make, the faint her tail she has to shake. For Nanny, far before the rest, hard upon noble Maggie pressed and flew at Tal with furious effort. But little was she Maggie's mettle. A spring brought tame her master heel, but left a hen, her own grey tail. The carlin clocked her by the rump and left poor Maggie with scarce a stump. Now, whom this trail of truth shall be, will come man and mother's son, tapped cheat, when e'er to drink the are inclined. Or cut his arts run in your mind, think. Ye may buy your joys o'er dear. Remember, Tam O'Shanter's me.